Now let's understand the law in detail. Law of variable proportions. What does it say? It says increase in some inputs. Increase in some inputs relative to other fixed inputs. Relative to other fixed inputs will in a given state of technology cause output to increase. It will cause the output to increase. But after a point, the extra output resulting from the ex from the same addition of extra inputs will become less and less. Now what does this statement say is when we increase the variable factor of production, the other factors of production remaining constant. Initially what will happen is our production will go on increasing. Our production will increase. But after a point, what will happen is even if we increase the amount of variable factor, our production will increase at a diminishing rate and finally it will go on decreasing. So initially it will increase at an increasing rate, then it will increase at a diminishing rate and finally it will decrease. We are talking about the total product here. So this explains us that the law happens in three stages. The first stage is the increasing returns where we get a higher production where the production increases at an increasing rate. Increases at an increasing rate. The second stage is the stage of diminishing returns. Now what happens in the stage of diminishing returns? Production increases at a diminishing rate. And finally we have the stage of negative returns. In negative returns the production does not increase but it decreases. Production starts to decrease. So we have three stages. The first stage is the stage of increasing returns where the production is increasing. It is not only increasing but it is increasing at an increasing rate with addition of every amount of variable factor of production, one unit of factor of production. What happens is the production increases and when I add one more unit of variable factor of production, the production increases but this time it will not increase at the same rate but it will increase at an increasing rate. This is the stage of increasing return. Second is the stage of diminishing returns. In the stage of diminishing returns, the production still increases when I employ an additional unit of variable factor, labor in our case. What will happen is the production will still increase, but it will not increase at the rate at which it has increased in the last level when the last unit of variable factor was added. So please note that in the first and second stage the production increases. However, in the first stage it increases at the increasing rate. In the second it increases at a diminishing rate. And finally in the third stage the production starts to decrease. It falls it goes down. So this is a level, this is a stage which is different from the first two. In this stage, the production is altogether falling. 